Hello there, it's Trish from Pinky's World and today I'm on sketch number four from Kendra's um, Car Challenge 2. Um, this one is quite basic again, just underneath layer, background layer, strip and then your top one which will be for you to stamp on or enjoy whatever way you want. I have gone with these colours today. My basic card is cut already. The background has been done with the beautiful florals again in um, Daffodil Delight papers or cards. Sorry. So I'm just going to glue this to the back. This is your first layer. And again, <laughs> plenty because this time, the last time I went to stick this, it wasn't uh, very happy. So I'm giving it lots of glue this time. Should probably use tape maybe. That would be an idea, but too late now. So just pop it on, make sure it's central. I do love that embossing folder, but it's well worth the hassle. So just press those big bits so the glue takes, hopefully. And as I say, anything that doesn't stick, I can go back in with my sticky dots and just slide it under. So that's your background layer, which is this one. You could leave that basic white or just the back of your card. You don't have to layer that up. This one is going on next, which is this layer. I'm not double layering it. You can see the black there. I'm just going with the single layer, which I hope is right. I'm sure it is. Um, I'm just gluing it on. I'm not going with the butterflies again because I've decided to go with a girly sort of type card since the colours were nice and bright. So I'm just sticking this flat as well in a wee bit. I'm giving it a wee bit of time. And this colour is Calypso Coral, which is in that particular pack. So it works well with the Daffodil Delight, I think. Nice and bright and sunny. Just needed to take. So the next part is your, your band across there, which goes from one side of the card to the other. And I thought it would sort of bring in the yellows and this side and the oranges this side. So I'm not layering it up either. I'm just stamping it or putting it straight down. I don't want to use the butterfly side again, which is the joy of double-sided papers. It gives you that chance and it is a wee bit down so just making sure it's straight and sticking that embossing folder is wicked just needs a wee bit of time to take because you could use your um tomboy glue it might stick quicker Though this is generally good at sticking, just make sure it's straight. Now, the top layer, I have gone with the matching card of this, which we'll just set about here. So we're seeing bits of everything. Um, my white card is going to go over the top of that, but we're going to put this on first. And I've went ahead and stamped out the two lipsticks, and I'll go with the matching sentiment so where do we want this about here so you can see a wee bit of the orange coming through see a bit of the yellow coming through and it gives it a nice tie in with the colors so this one is just going to go flat but i want to be able to stick or stamp the sentiment down so i know these are going to go one's going to be flat down one's going to be Overlap on the other. I've went with the the clips of Carl to match. I'm going to put a wee bit of the flowers in the corners just to add the yellow. This one I accidentally chopped off my leaves, so it'll sit up in the corner. So I want my sentiment to fit in here. I'm just going to go with black so that it's all um, toning in just. And it says be as bold as your lipstick and it's out of the dress to impress stamp set which is really cool for girly cards so give that a go if you fancy it so be as bold as your lipstick will sit up 
right here. And then we'll add these things on. This one is going to go down flat. Add a wee jaunty angle. This one is layered up already with 3D film. And it'll sort of cover the top. Could have stamped, I should have stamped actually the lipsticky thing underneath, but too late now. I have these on dimensionals as well, which we'll add here with the leaf coming out the way. Oops. Fill in that corner and we'll put these ones up at the top. And you could add more if you feel it's missing something. Just keep adding a wee flower till you're happy. And then we're just going to stick this on flat again. Oops, and there you have a nice sweet girly card in bright and sunny colours for spring. Just make sure it's central. And there you have it. Another wee card, quickly done. No fuss and bother. I mean, it didn't take me long at all doing that there. So, uh, card number four done. Catch us all later. Bye.